We're in Spearfish, South Dakota at the high school visiting with our boys high school basketball coach, Eric Skoglin. And uh, Eric, thanks for joining us here on Black Hills TV. Absolutely, you know, I would love to promote Spartan basketball as much as we can, get out as, as, uh, as much as we can to sell our program to not only our fans, our community, and our families. Yeah. Great time of year with the season starting up. Everyone's undefeated and uh, about ready to get underway. You know, it's a new year. Uh, not only our team, everyone else. You got seniors who left. You got upperclassmen who are a year older. You got eighth graders who are just coming from junior high practices a year ago, stepping in, play with the big boys. You know, it's a very exciting time for Spartan basketball. We've had 55 kids in the gym for open gyms and our lifting sessions in the fall as we have eighth graders through 12th graders, 55 of them uh, working out, getting excited for the season. Boy, outstanding. Who are some of those seniors that you're going to be missing this year? Well, we had four seniors graduate last year, and now we have six uh, of them who are now returning. So uh, they have been doing an outstanding job leading us, modeling for our underclassmen uh, on how we do things the Spartan basketball way in the weight room and on, and on the basketball floor. You know, some of our seniors, Logan Ammerman, Cade Lyon, John Nichols, Ryan Peldo, Jake Powell, Aiden Woods, those guys have been in the program these, these entire years that I've been here the last three. Uh, so we are leaning on them for scoring, defense, and all the above. You run a fast offense? We attempt to. Uh, we're going to, again, go to our skill. Don't think about plays, think about players. But our guys have uh, bought in. We have to move the ball because when you go up against a Yankton team who arguably was one of the top teams in the state, absolutely top four, they want to be playing the state title game last year uh, with Mr. Moores and outstanding, the, uh, one of the top players in the state the last 20 years. And then we'll, uh, on a Saturday night, we'll go to Brandon Valley, who are the defending state champs. So, you know, what an opportunity for us. Uh, but again, with those type of players and athletes on the team, we've got to do it with the team because one or two of us just can't do it alone. Tough competition to start the season, but there's an old saying, to, to be the best, you've got to beat the best. Absolutely. And, uh, you know, uh, it's going to tell us where we are. Uh, we are sick of practicing against ourselves playing against ourselves all summer and into the fall. So it's time to play someone with a different uniform on. And then right here uh, locally in your own conference, you probably got some tough competition coming up this year too. Absolutely. Up and down the lineup. Uh, you know, I don't get into uh, predicting before Christmas because everyone is different. Uh, every team has either improved, stayed the same, or got worse. But again, they'll find their new identity, and by Christmas time, uh, everyone has enough game film or whether you saw them live to uh, predict and, and uh, make some coffee shop predictions that uh, everyone wants to talk about. How long have you been the basketball coach here at Spearfish? This is my third year at Spearfish. Uh, the, the past four were at Mitchell, and prior to that, we were at Spearfish for five years. Prior to that, we were at uh, Black Hill State for a couple. Uh, been at uh, McCook Central on the girls' side, so... Uh, um, I love this profession. It uh, is, is taking me a lot of places. So you're a, a basketball player yourself from, from, from years past? Uh, my background, I'm a, I'm a Howard High graduate mm -hmm. of 94, uh, U University of Sioux Falls graduate 98. So uh, uh, I've been lucky enough. And it's all about timing and recruiting and having a chance to play. But uh, uh, some of my uh, best friends are through the basketball team as we've had uh, you know, similar goals and, and philosophies and, uh, and strengths. Eric, we, uh, we appreciate being able to visit with you, and we're going to be visiting with you quite a bit uh, as the season goes on. Outstanding. Uh, again, we'd love to promote Spartan basketball and our Maroon team. Thank you. Right. Go Spartans. Thank you, sir.